the 24 hours in a day that you are living, that you're breathing, is yours. Nobody else's. CEOs, what's up? It's your boy CEO Abish. I'm back with another video. And you see how I said CEOs instead of YouTube? Yeah, I was just thinking to myself like last night. I was like, bruh, why am I even saying YouTube? Like, you're watching the video. Yeah, I get it on YouTube, but all I know for sure is you're the CEO of your own life. You feel me? So from now on, when I start my videos, I'm going to be addressing y'all as CEOs uh, because for sure you're in control of your life. And until one day, you know what I'm saying? Um, I'm sure I'll get to know who you are, what your name is actually. But till then, I'm going to call you, yes, you, CEO. Anyways, um, I just got done with my workout. Um, and now I'm about to get me some food and then we're going to jump into this video. So I'll see you guys in a sec. This is CEOs, let's just get into this. Um, so this video is gonna be about being intentional. I think the title is gonna be something around, I mean, along the lines of remaining positive. I mean, not remaining positive, always be positive though. Remaining intentional, keyword intentional. And what we're really focusing on with our intentions is our habits, um, our energy, and the time that we spend. So we're gonna start off with our energy, right? So being intentional with your energy, your energy is a source of power that helps get things done. If your energy is drained, you're not gonna be efficient. So remain cautious and aware with what you use your energy on. Sometimes we think certain things would be nice like kicking it with the bros all day. And if, if there was, I can't even speak, okay, hold on. And if there wasn't anything productive done in that time, that basically just means that that time that you spent kicking it with your bros all day, like in reality, that was just a waste of time, waste of energy, not time. Well, really time as well, but energy. Uh, being intentional with your time. The, 20, the 24 hours in a day that you are living, that you're breathing is yours, nobody else's. So whenever you're about to prioritize something, make sure that it's really worth your time. Um, not because it just sounds good to you, um, cause that just correlates to comfort and comfort isn't what we're aiming for, right? That's not what you're aiming for. You're aiming for satisfaction and then some, and then with habits, be intentional with your habits. What you do on a daily matters the most. It helps define what your future is going to be like. Say you have a habit of just sleeping in, right? Well, there's a good chance of you to be the type of person to wake up late in the day and end your day late, meaning almost like the next day type thing, like past midnight, uh, depending on the task that you have. So remain aware of what your tendencies are and be real with yourself. Make sure that those are habits that you that keep help, like basically make sure that those habits keep you sharp and on track. Earlier, I mentioned something about spending time with spending time with the bros. I just want to make this clear: like spending time with the bros is not a bad thing. But when it comes down to your habits, make sure that it's not something that you're consistently doing. Especially because if it's not productive, then that's just a that's a bad habit. There's always a time and place for things, and spending time with your bros, anyone, even your friends or your family members, that's totally understandable. But if nothing's being productive, if you're just sitting around just chilling, like that's just a waste of time and it's not gonna help you. And that's a bad habit. So you gotta be real with yourself. Uh, so yeah, uh, make sure that so, make sure that something you do daily because that, that can be a habit that doesn't make you productive and be efficient with your time. That's basically what I was saying in that. Um, but yeah, so what did we just mention? Three things, all right? Being intentional with our time, being intentional with our habits, and being intentional with our energy. Yeah, I'm sorry. I've kind of slow. I had people over today. I was trying to have this video done earlier, but it kind of like messed up my whole kind of schedule, but I was being patient. It's cool. Um, but yeah, um, being intentional is really crucial. You don't want to just be sitting around and just not being aware of what you're doing with your time you know every single day is a day for you to get better 
And I feel as though that like, if you focus on those three things, your time, your energy, and your habits, you're pretty, you're pretty much unstoppable, bro. You know, like how LeBron is like, kind of like, kind of OP in 2 okay, like not kind of, he's OP in 2K, even like the Hall of Fame, that's basically how it is. If you, if you can focus and, and be intentional with your, your habits, with your energy and your time, bro, you might be even better than the Hall of Fame LeBron. I'm just, I'm just going to be honest with you, but, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, give me one sec. I'll be right back. Okay, see you guys. I'm back. And uh, <clears throat> if you watched yesterday's video, I said I was gonna see you're gonna. Well, I was gonna see you now. You're gonna see a smoothie in my hand, in a, in in the next video. So yes, I finally got my smoothies back in order. Um, yeah, Brian needed them smoothies. But anyways, I just wanted to end off this video, of course, with a quote. Today's is gonna be with a quote, or really like a statement, actually, that goes with what we talked about today and it goes like this in a world of in a world full of lazy uninspired people who aren't willing to do anything but bare but the bare minimum if you can prove yourself to be different to go above and beyond to learn and grow to add more value than anyone else if you can do that consistently you'll almost guarantee a very successful life i'm gonna say that one more time in a world full of lazy, uninspired people who aren't willing to do anything but the bare minimum. If you can prove yourself to be different, to go above and beyond, to learn and grow, to add more value than anyone else, if you can do that consistently, you'll almost guarantee a very successful life. So to do that though, you definitely need to be intentional. You need to be intentional with what you do with your time, your energy, as well with your habits. So that's pretty much it that I wanted to leave y'all with for today's video. Hopefully you can add it to your life, to your lifestyle, add something new that I mentioned, or reaffirm if it's something that you already know. Um, but that's pretty much it. I'm about to go be productive with the rest of my day, go get some money, just hustle, just grind. Um, hopefully you're having a good day whenever Whenever you're watching this, could be a year from now, it could be two years from now, it could be even tomorrow, I don't even know. It could be even today. Um, but for you, for you, yes, you, Auntie Anta, who decided to watch this whole video, I fucks with you. Just know, like, anytime, like, if you get to the end of these videos, bruh, and you watch the whole thing, I really fucks with you, because I'm speaking some real shit. Some people want to just watch the first 30 seconds and then it's just like, all right, whatever. It's cool. You know what I'm saying? I'm like that for certain videos, too. That's totally fine. But you fucking with my video, I fuck with you, basically. So I appreciate it nonetheless. Um, smoothie, man. But anyways, um, I'm pretty much going to wrap it up here. Um, I'm going to catch y'all. I'm going to catch y'all. See you guys tomorrow. Um, and yeah, I love y'all. Y'all have a great day. Peace. Whoa, 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 wait, wait. Before I say peace, I gotta end it off right, right? It's your boy, see you always, and I'm out. Peace. Love y'all.